It's the Daily Dan with the Daily Dan blog. I heard something creepy in the woods earlier. I went down and I was searching around and you'll see that video earlier. And I thought I saw a shine and I thought I saw something moving around. And it was pretty freaky. I was thinking, uh, Harry Bastard, the southern Sasquatch was back. And I filmed a little bit. But I am definitely hearing something bigger this time. And I filmed a little bit. And right after I cut the camera off, a fucking deer jumped out the woods and scared the EP Jesus dog shit out of me. And I busted around in its ass. Too bad I didn't have the camera on. That would have been a good video. It ran off bleeding in the woods. I did hear something snap over here just now really bad. I swear to God. I hope the camera caught the sound over my big mouth. If I be quiet for a few minutes, you'll know why. distance something made a sound but I don't know what it was I'm wearing a flashlight on my side and I got one in my hand and a gun over here not a fucking thing now but I heard limbs break right in here. But now nothing, not a peep. In my heart, I really believe whatever made them sounds moved off. And I think this is another fucking deer. You hear the dead quiet, nothing but the fucking crickets. It's never this quiet here. Anyway, I don't want to run long because YouTube don't like videos that run long. Okay, don't get mad about that. There is one thing I want to point out to the YouTube audience and the Bigfoot people out there real quick. And I don't know if they noticed or not. Up there, behind that fucking tree, <laughs> part of my language, I have a very foul mouth, is the big full moon. Now what I notice is when it's rainy and cloudy and a lot darker out here and there's not a big full moon, there was a lot of crap going on. But the last couple of days it's been a three quarters moon and a big moon, big shiny moon, and I haven't heard jack hardly. No big activity, no howling, no moaning, no groaning. I wonder if the big bright moon makes it easier for them to be seen and they stick to the deep forest during that time and only come up around the residential areas when it's cloudy and rainy and they have a better chance of not being seen. Really. If anybody out there knows a lot about you, Bigfoot and degrees with that theory, let me know in the comments or contact somebody who does know and tell them to send me some freaking help. All right. This is Danny Staten for the Daily, the Daily Damn Blog. Alone in quiet South Carolina. Wishing for some action, really. To make life more interesting. It's boring it. Three o'clock in the morning. I can't even watch video games. He done went to bed. My God. All right. This is the Daily Dan for the Daily Dan blog saying, blog over.